Here's a three month review on my favorite in room air conditioning unit. This thing has been so wonderful for us. We live in an attic bedroom. We actually moved into another attic bedroom that also has insufficient AC. And this helps me sleep at night. It keeps the space much cooler. It is not as powerful as a full AC system, understandably, but it is whisper quiet and I really, really enjoyed it. Let me show you a couple of things I've learned about it over the last three months. Now I normally stop the oscillation when I'm sleeping because I just want it aimed at me and it's such a nice low breeze that it just feels really nice while I'm sleeping. Now it has a variety of fan speeds. In the evening, I'll usually have it at one and in sleep mode, so it's super quiet. And in the daytime, I'll turn it on a little louder and move it up. And this really helps cool down the space, especially in the daytime if you turn on oscillation as well, as it just kind of works through the whole space. Now the next trick with it is that right now it is just a fan. And you can put it in front of an inadequate AC system and it will do a great job, or you can add water to it. If you add ice water or ice to it, it makes a huge difference. Let me show you how to put that in. And all you do is pull out this back drawer and this is where the water and the ice go. The one thing I have noticed is it does get a little yellowed in there. So you do need to clean this out from time to time. But all I do is I make sure it's clean in there and then I fill it with water. And I don't normally fill it all the way for the same reason because the water can get kind of dirty. I don't want a ton of water in it. I just want enough for the day. And then if it's a really hot day and I need it to be even cooler in here, I add the ice packs. Now, if I filled it up all the way, these ice packs would probably make a bigger difference. But if I have cold water and the ice packs in, that is great. And this just slides in. Sometimes it slides in rather awkwardly. And if it does slide in awkwardly, that usually means these cords have gotten pulled down too much. So what you want to do is kind of tuck them up in a little more and then slide it in. Don't force it if it doesn't want to slide in. And there you have it. And to take advantage of that ice water, you have to do one more thing. And that's hit this little button right here. And that will pull from the water tank and it'll send a little of that cool water through the fan. And it really, really makes a difference. Almost immediately, I can feel that it is cooler. I highly recommend this AC unit. It has made such a difference for me and I know it will for you as well.